A camera bag is important for every filmmaker, and I bring mine almost everywhere, and this is what I carry in mind. First of all, my camera bag is the KNF Concept Beta Backpack, which this bag has got three different compartments. The first compartment is a really small one, I normally keep a penny in just in case I need it for any tripods. A top compartment, which we will get to later, and then also a big compartment which I normally keep everything in. The big compartment has velcro dividers in it and just so it helps separate my camera gear and then also I've also got a side access pocket where I normally keep a spare SD card and a spare battery and this is where my camera normally is. My camera is a Sony a Mark IV. I did get this with my uni maintenance loan when it came in and it only currently has the kit lens on it but I do want to get more lenses in the future, but I am bro. The specs of this camera are a 33 megapixel sensor, 1080p recording at 120 frames per second, a 4K 60fps, 5.5 stops of image stabilisation, and S-Log3, which S-Log3 does give me a massive control over the colours in the actual video, as, and this is what the video looks like without any colour correction, colour grading, or anything like that. This is all S-Log3. And then and this is what it looks like with the grading and colour grading. It just helps control the colour more. If you do want a more in-depth video about how I got my camera, the specs of the camera, you can watch this video here. Or if you want any more information about the camera, please put it down in the comments below. On my camera, I also have a small rig camera cage for it, which it is for when I actually start rigging out my camera, which I do definitely want to do soon. The pocket next to my filter has my filter bag from KNF Concept. Uh, this has got three filters in. It's my variable ND filter, which is basically sunglasses for your camera. It's a KNF Concept one. I do really recommend getting it. A polarizer, which I haven't really actually used yet, but I definitely do want to use this year. And then also a UV filter, which again I haven't used at all, but I do want to use it more in the future when I start doing more things and with my camera, which could be dangerous for the lens. I've also picked up some. Uh, star filters which these star filters just give an extra element if you have a light in your image it creates a star or X effect in your image I haven't got a chance to use this just yet but I definitely want to use it and just to fit all of the filters onto my actual camera lens I am using the KNF concept step up rings just as uh, I did want to only buy one filter and I got the biggest size, which is an 85mm. And just so then the step up rings go up from. For this camera lens, it's a 55mm diameter. So then my big filters need the step up rings to actually attach onto it. I also have an SD card case, which isn't full yet. It's only really got micro SD cards in. But I do want to get more of my Lexar. 1 and 28 gigabytes for my actual camera which I'm using to film my videos. Above this pocket I will normally have my 4TB Lacey uh, and rugged hard drive which has got work, uni work, these videos, my homework folder. I normally just have this just in case I do need it for any research. A new addition to my camera bag is a Manuta uh, Rocker 58mm f1.7 camera lens. This is an old film camera lens which I have to use a KNF adapter for but it's an all manual focus, all manual lens but then I do want to use it a lot this year especially with portraiture. I also have a camera strap in my bag which is using the PGY Tech quick release system which is a small little balls attached to my camera and then I put it onto the other part on the actual strap and then it also gives a nice satisfying click. The mic I normally carry is the Deity uh, D4 Duo mic. This mic films in a cardioid polar pattern and then also it's got a little switch on the back to make it omnidirectional which cardioid is just how it picks up, it only really picks up the front, then omnidirectional is everywhere. Then I want to get the, a wireless system like the Rode wireless system because I want to get that 32 bit flow. But I do really recommend my Deity mic, I'm currently using it right now. The last thing in this part of my bag is a black bag which normally has my camera body cap in it and the rear lens cap for my 
lens. This is just so, just in case I'm changing lenses or I need to do anything like that, it's just much easier. But then also, the I also have a focus card which also works as a white balance card and so I can use that whenever I want. Just make sure I have white balance or just in case just to check if I have focus as well. In the back of my bag I also have any paper documents I carry for uni or anything like that. My notebook which I normally write video ideas, to-do lists or anything like that in. Then I also have a laptop but th this will come in a later video which just stay tuned for. In the top compartment on my bag I will normally have a sharpie, a small rig multi-tool, a white pen, a spare battery, first aid kit. They're normally always the things and then my girlfriend got me the small rig multi-tool. I also have my MX Master 2 because I'm not using the Apple Magic Mouses because they're terrible. Then I'll also normally sometimes have my laptop charger, a power bank, and any cables I need for the power bank. On the outside pocket, I have my Mantis pad, which is made by PGY Tech. It uses a quick release system, which is quite easy to use, and it's just a small tripod if I'm traveling, I need it, or it's I can use it when I'm talking to the camera, like holding it in front of me which I still need to practice. Then I also have the PGY Tech Beetle Clip, which when I'm walking, instead of using the camera strap because I don't really like using it, I just put, attach my camera onto the camera strap through the Beetle Clip and just so my hands are free while I'm walking so I don't have to constantly hold my camera. Then the last thing on the front of my bag is a little pin badge of a duck on, with a skateboard my girlfriend got me. 